So I'm telling you, this life just keeps on getting better and better and better. It's, it's, the further I get along, the more questions open up. The more exciting everything becomes, the more colorful everything becomes. Also, all the inner workings, working all of that. Connecting with the divine is connecting inwardly. I guess it's also uh, externally. I just want to talk out what I'm what I'm going through so on the twin flame journey right so coming into my higher self and losing dependency it's the letting go the surrendering and just allowing what will be will be so it's not trying to hold on to anything or or you know it's more of like a letting go and then allowing so I'm on my way to the Rob Roy. It's Friday afternoon. And I keep on going back and forth with myself in between these two different mindsets. And I am seeing both perspectives. And I'm trying to see if there, if I personally have underneath any hidden agendas that I'm not seeing. So, I'm, a car just went by and it had its back bumper like flying in the wind. So, okay, so I got up today I invited my my three boys are are with me for the weekend and and well my three boys are there now they came for for di they're coming they're they're for, they came for dinner I and I made a dinner so I spent so this morning I uh, cook, I went to the supermarket and I cooked and I cleaned and I got the house ready and my daughter's coming also and she's going to be there she said that she's going to be there at around 8 and my boys got there early in the afternoon and I got everything all ready even the table set and we still need a few, a few uh, chairs that I told the boys to bring and so I was debating if I want to go to the Rob Roy, if I don't want to go to the Rob Roy, if I want to stay home and just make it like, uh, um, make atmosphere, you know, just be home with my boys. And when I was debating out loud, my boys told me, well, if you want to go, just go. You know, go and have fun. And I keep on going back and forth with myself. I'm trying to stay as true to myself as possible. And there's so many different sides to this. So the first and obvious question is, am I going in hopes of seeing my twin? And that comes up like,
And so then to check with myself, I say, okay, if he's not there and there's no chance of him being there, would you still want to go? And then starts in the debate. Would I still want to go? And I've been, because of that should be my, my measure. Because if that, if, if it is, if, if the reason I want to go is in hopes of seeing him, then that's chasing. And then I'm going, and then that is defeating the purpose. Friday afternoon, uh, the meal's ready, it allows me to go and meet with people and just be off the hook and dance, and if he's there, then that's just an added added to the party. So that was what I came up with. And and just the comfort in knowing that I can change my mind and I can just, if, if I don't want to be there, I can just change my mind and leave at any time. I'm free to always, to always make a different decision. That's something that my meditation really helps with. Calming the mind and just being in the moment, so. Wait, no, no. I don't want cookies. No, thank you. No, I don't want. So in any case, the dogs will have fun. And so will I. Okay, so those are my debates. And I feel pretty good about talking it out because now I, I feel confident and besides, I'm almost there, so I might as well. Okay. 